have a fun craft that we wanted to share. What are we going to use? Toilet paper roll. A toilet paper roll. And what are we going to make with that? Little pots. Little pots. So what we've done, the first step is to cut the toilet paper roll in half. So we've done that over here. And we're going to make these little seed pots to do some seed starting. Instead of using something like this, which again, we recycled using this. This plastic pot used to have an herb in it when we bought it um, from the nursery. We washed it out and we planted seeds to grow squash. So that's one way to recycle using a plastic pot. But here's a way that you can recycle something like a toilet paper roll or a paper towel roll. And these paper pots will decompose. Do you know what that means, Ava? What does decompose mean? Um, to recycle? Well, they, they, we, we are recycling, but when something decomposes, what happens when we put these in the earth? If we plant this whole toilet paper roll, what's gonna happen to it? Will it stay there forever? No. No, what will happen to it? It will dissolve. Like dissolve, break down, that's what decomposition is. So it's gonna decompose and become part of the earth. Ava's gonna take the piece of paper, it's just regular notebook paper, open that up, Ava. We've cut it in half and folded it because we learned that you need to double the paper for it to be strong enough. And she's gonna take one of those toilet paper halves. You wanna take one out of the basket? And she's gonna fold it around and get it around the toilet paper roll. And then we're gonna wrap masking tape. So we found that a single sheet of notebook paper is too thin. We also learned you need quite a good amount of masking tape to reinforce it so that it doesn't break apart when you water it. You need two. Now we're going to fill up. You girls need to stand up so you can yes. see. We're going to fill up our little pots with soil. This is just regular potting soil. You, you wouldn't want to use heavy um, garden soil. It needs to be a potting soil that has perlite in it so it's very lightweight. And you're going to fill it up almost to the top. Good job. And then you can set it back down in the tray. That's good. Now it's time for planting. We have our little pots filled up. And what kind of seeds? You know what those are? No. They're, they're zinnias, but they're a new variety that we've never grown before. But I just thought those were so pretty. Redmond Super Cactus. Zinnias. And the seeds look like... Yeah, let's oh. see those seeds. Uh-oh, did you drop one? Yeah, put some in your pointy. hand. They're pointy? Yeah. You put one in your open hand. Let's see what they look like. Little or big? Big. Big. What color are they? Brown. Brown. Uh-oh. Get another one for your sister. And are they soft or hard? Hard. So these are all physical properties you're naming, right? Just like a scientist. Awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and just put, let's put two in each little pot. We don't want to crowd them, but sometimes seeds don't germinate. Even though you've done everything right, they just don't grow. So let's go ahead and put two seeds in each. Okay, good. Let me see what those look like. There they are. And the last step is watering. Just water your one and let your sister water hers. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of water. It's good to have some type of tray so that there's support at the bottom. It should take about a week and we're just gonna keep it evenly moist. We don't need a whole lot of water, right, girls? Just a little bit to keep the soil moist. And then the cool thing about this planting is that now, can you pick one of those up, Ava? When it's time for planting, um, once you see a little sprout, these pots are going to decompose in the ground. You don't have to take the little sprout out of the pot, like the plastic one. We can't plant this, can we? What would happen if we tried to put this plastic in the ground? Um, it, it will um, not grow. It would stay there forever and the plant wouldn't grow, but this pot made of paper will decompose and it'll just become part of the earth. So that's our project for today, using toilet paper rolls. Shut up.